Hey guys, it is Monday, July 3rd, 2017. Wow, Mandy, July already. I know, it's summer's here. Absolutely, and uh, we have some more room designs for you right here today, and we're gonna get right to them. Here is a beautiful Kinsville library that was created by Grandpa's Beauty. This is great. Look at the learning stations that they've set up with, yep. the computer stations, and then there's mm -hmm. some tables with laptops, exactly as you would imagine would be in a library. It looks like a real library. Well, yeah, and then it's neat the way they've set up some of the bookcases at an angle, mm -hmm. and yeah, so it creates like a, a little reading nook there. Totally. It's Most really of the stuff you see there you can get actually at the W Shop, but yeah. I love that wallpaper. That's and from the e-store. But yeah, it's awesome. I love it. It is. I think it's at the Persian Library. Well, I, mean, I can't Something, yeah. Remember. We, I yeah. think it was created to promote the Persian Cats yeah. um, Kins Tune video. But uh, yeah. I like the way they've added those wall sconces. Like the glow yeah. uh, looks so cool against the bookcases. Yeah, beautiful glow, beautiful design. And I just noticed that glow too. That's a great added touch in the library. Yeah, and that was from the Cookie Science theme. That was a rare theme that's no longer available. But uh, Grandpa's Cutie managed to pick one up so great job and great design let's move on here's a treetop garden and it's sent in by green magic 77 and mandy there's that pond again that pond and this feels like such a sort of tranquil getaway and it's got all the nice different parts of a yard like there's a garden and then there's a patio where you can sit and look at the way that yeah. green magic's placed all those flowers around that bench that i love that yeah that's so awesome pretty. i know like having the flowers on that floor tile it really makes them pop. Yeah. That's such a neat idea. Really calming, really beautiful. Lots of little spaces to kind of sit down and reflect. Like I love that little stone chair and side table that was originally from a trading card prize, but we, I believe we featured them on one of our wheels recently too. But uh, yeah. Yeah. And that, uh, I can't remember the exact name, but that spider web hammock was, we gave it away at Halloween, mm -hmm. but I love the rock features. Like you, right. I love seeing rock features in a garden. So it's totally. perfect. Perfect. You know, you don't need it to be Halloween to use that hammock. No, nope, exactly. So great job, Green Magic 77. Let's move on here. Always love seeing new designs. And it's, I love this one. It's a toy shop. Oh, and it was sent cute. in by Duncan 8. Oh, it uses really simple walls. And then those windows mm -hmm. just pop against the white walls. And so do the posters. Like there's our Silly Scoops poster. Yeah, we gave and, that away recently. Yeah. And the commas. That's an old one. Mm -hmm. And uh but yeah, lots of cute plushies and toys. This is just great. This totally does look like a toy shop that you would see maybe in New York or something with that nice hardwood flooring, very urban. And there's the cash register set up. It was a really interesting use of the cash register here because that is from the general store theme. But I mean, there's nothing about it that really would suggest that it has to be placed in a grocery store. It really works for any sort of retail space, including the toy shop here. So Duncan, you did a great job with your toy shop. Let's move on. Here's a restful retreat. And this was sent in by DJH89. And Mandy, I've got to say, I love those Campkins lake tiles that yeah. they've used in the in the center here of the room. Yeah, me too. I, I went in the trading room and traded for some of the stuff to make those. But yeah, I love the way that they've surrounded it with the stepping stones. I can't I can't remember the name of those, but they're just W Shop stepping yep. stones, yep. right? Mm -hmm. And then they've also used those pieces from the mod patio theme yes. that you got during the flower collection event mm -hmm. and the pinks really pick out uh, like that storefront it just it all feels like a sort of welcoming totally. little space that storefront i should mention was given away during a deluxe challenge which i love those months every month we release a challenge yeah. um, that you need to be a deluxe member to complete but every month the, the prizes seem to get better and better we recently had was it like a lifeguard atv yeah and, yeah. A, and a jacket was it the jacket? yeah like, yeah Car jacket, yeah, and, and of course we had this um, flower shop. Really, really interesting, unique stuff. And um, looks like DJ H89 really was inspired by that and built the whole room around it. So great job, love your restful retreat. Now here is a treat. It's a room designed by our friend Autumn, and it's Autumn's Beaver Den. Now look at this. There's so much stuff going on here, but it just looks like a really playful, fun, bright, happy place for these woodland and pets to hang out and play. Oh, beautiful. I have never seen, would you call them a stump? Maybe they're a PSI. 
PSI. Are they the beavers PSI, those sort of half-eaten trees? Right. I don't know if it's the PSI, but okay. um, but yeah, definitely really cool kind of little hollowed out seating area. Yeah. And what Autumn's done is use the peaceful forest wallpaper, which again yep. is really nice. One of our extended wallpapers and with those lights, but they've layered it with so many neat different water features and trees and the way they've mixed it all in you really feel like you're looking into a sort of wild scene yeah it's almost like a water park but a completely yeah. natural water exactly. park you know because it looks like if you look at that there's that glow bug in the back it looks like it's sliding oh, down a yeah. log almost into the water but uh, really really neat um, design is always autumn so and i like how autumn caught that frog just looking up yep. giving a smile <laughs> exactly lots of attention to details now this is pretty cool this room was sent in by deeds and it's a police headquarters now mandy we recently actually well i don't know how recent it was but we do have um, a puppy patrol kind of police theme yeah. in the e-store. What I really like here is that Deeds didn't use any of our police items to create this room. They completely kind of combined all different sort of items to make this police headquarters, including those Kinsville Academy fence pieces, yes, which they've it. created a jail. And I love it. It's the skunk <laughs> that's in the jail there. Oh, dear. Yeah. Yes. Deeds didn't need the Paw Patrol stuff. They used their imagination. And I just love it. I feel like here's a work area or maybe Maybe you could question the suspects here. Yeah. And, you know, there's a reception area mm -hmm. and lots of filing cabinets because you have to keep files on your yep. on your cases and, and yeah, a little sort of eating area. Break so. room, yeah, with a cup of coffee, yeah. nice touch or cocoa. And um, that pet there, the husky, is wearing a police uniform. Cute. Yeah, it's actually um, a security guard uniform, but hey, it could it be a works. police uniform as well. Yeah, yeah, and it's available when you make it to the mall in the game of Spree. You can use your mall credits to trade for that uniform. So there you go. And yeah, I love the detective sitting at that desk there, you know, with the hat. Really, really cool. Great, Great. job, Deeds. Very creative. This one is beautiful. It's really well put together and it's a springtime bedroom and it was sent in by Ninja Go Zane. Wow, you know what? They didn't use a big room and yet look how much they got in and without making it feel cramped. Like, you know, I think that sectional um, from the Mod Patio, yes. they worked really nicely because you get such a big seating area mm -hmm. when you join it together and so it's kind of compact but yeah, they really organized it so that even though there's so much going on it doesn't feel cluttered and there's so colorful it's yeah very colorful but all the colors work together yeah. there's a lot of different items that were used here like as you were saying the mod patio set there's the nice dark flooring from the creative studio theme that really makes these colors pop and yeah i love that they put in the four corner or the three corners there of the room they've used these creative studio columns which you could make out of uh, baked goods from our last bake sale yeah and i always like those yeah. flower couches and chairs they are such a statement piece yes yeah totally Totally. And classic ice box in the left there, Mandy, nice. from our country team. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that was from the W Shop as well. And of course, there's some beautiful springtime windows that they've added to the walls that were from our spring celebration event. So great yeah. job. It's a sunny springtime day today. Yes, yes. absolutely. <laughs> there are rainy ones as well available. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, now this one I thought was really cool. Never seen anything like it before. It was sent in by Novadel, and it's an optical illusion. Wow. And it really literally is an optical illusion. Illusion. It totally is. Because you have to think about how they have placed those in order to get that raised look. And, yeah. You know, you can't stack them in WebKins. So no. they, they really have created an optical illusion. It almost looks like a pyramid or something yeah. that you can climb up. Yeah. And those are oh. actually counters that you can get from um, the W Shop under furniture and kitchen. And um, yeah, the way that they've arranged them here just gives it the illusion that they're actually stacked yeah. up on top of each other. But really all they are is as carefully laid out in the room but I thought it was it's really really cool amazing and also yeah. just like the black walls and mm -hmm. the dark floor and then the color of green everything just works wow absolutely so great job Novadel. do you guys have an optical illusion that you want to recreate in your room because we would love to see it we and sure would. Uh, yeah and actually we'd love to see any kind of room designs that you guys come up with because you all are so creative 
and we just want to share your designs with the rest of the Webkins News community. And so you can email them to me at letsbuild.gans.com and check out our YouTube channel, guys, youtube.com slash Webkins. And don't forget to subscribe so you'll never miss a new episode of Podkins or these uh, room design videos and all cool stuff coming out of Webkins World. So there you go. Thank you, Mandy. Thank you. And thanks, guys, for watching, and we'll see you soon. Bye. Bye.